Monaco knew they had to win to keep pace at the top of the division and they hosted a Brest side only five points adrift in the table. Despite a brave showing against PSG, Eric Roy's Bretons fell to defeat at the Stade Louis II. They wanted to avoid a fifth match winless. Adi Hütter saw a three-match winning streak fall at Lille. The Austrian wanted a response to draw within a point of PSG and above Nice before their Côte d'Azur neighbours face them. Yet it looked to have been a bad start for the hosts, as it was in the north last week. Jeremy Le Touaron celebrated, but then it was pulled back by VAR for a foul by Pierre Lesmelu on Fuller and Balogun. The referee Eric Watelier ruling out two goals for Brest. In between, Denis Zakaria got his first Liga Nubris goal since signing permanently for Monaco from Juventus. The Russian has been in sparkling form. His wicked delivery completely caught out Marco Bizot behind the Swiss international, who nodded in to the unguarded net. Monaco had won each of the last three Liga Uber games against Brest. That was after losing four of their previous six. Luther encouraging his players. It's Balogun who had Lionel Brassier in a spin. The booking that would prove costly later for the Brest defender. Brassier again on Balogun. Was it penalised or booked? The referee played fantastic. Advantage. Golovin with the finish. An assist for the first. Goal to make it five in his last seven outings. After injury issues interrupted his spell with Monaco. Russian gem. He's on fire. 2 0. Monaco cruising. Although they'd have their woodwork to thank for keeping Eric Wa's men at bay. Brendan Chardonnay clipping the post. It was kept alive by Steve Meunier. But Pierre Les Melu thumping high and over. He rediscovered his shooting aim. Soon after, what a save, Philip Kuhn. The bar helping the young goalkeeper. He got a strong hand to it and earned his slice of luck. And Brassier, eventually it was one challenge too many. And it was a first professional red card of the 24-year-old's career. Monaco remain on the podium while Brest are fifth in the table, but eight points adrift.